Ocean, Indigenous Valley, Banana and Sugarcane Plantations. This property in Ramsgate has beauty all around it. And the first big decision for owners David and Bonita Smythe was which way to face their new house. The first of many possible debates. When a couple almost signed a marriage contract just before they built their dream home, they really had no idea what would happen. From the word go, Lorna was on Benita's side, particularly after this welcome. Oh, 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 Thank you. Come with you with us. It was the work of Arthur Quinton, Daryl Croom Architects that the Smythes saw on top billing. Although Daryl is from the Cape, they decided they'd try a long-distance working relationship. This is really just so exquisite. The impression we've tried to create here is that when our guests and friends arrive here that they get the whole feeling of what the South Coast is all about. I just have to know, tell me about this contract. Our friends said that this process can be a big stress on a family and a wedding and a marriage. So. But my brother did say, do yourselves a favour, sign a contract that you'll still be together at the end of this. <laughs> and we said, yeah, yeah, but it didn't go that way. We just enjoyed every yeah. minute. Everyone worked well with us. It was just incredible. No, we think the house really reflects uh, our clients as a couple, that warm, inviting nature they have. And the best way really is to show you how the house lays itself out and down to the garden areas. A major hurdle was starting construction at the same time that the World Cup stadiums were being built. Material was hard to source, yet KZN managed to build both the Moses Mabida Stadium and this house at the same time. Lorna, from here we can see how the house works in terms of its levels. It's a series of levels, and each one defined in its own way. There's the bedroom level, the living level, and of course the garden level that all work together to give um, what is a very special feel to the site. It really does have a nautical feel about it. The house looks like a big ship. Well, I'm glad you mentioned that. Manita and I like to go sailing on our holidays with some special friends of ours and we did mention this to the architects and they've managed to bring that out in the house. So. Yeah, we think it comes through in some of the detailing. You'll see a ship's ladder, you'll see balustrading, which is typical of an ocean liner and there is a sense of being by the sea. I just love how the garden flows into the coastal forest. It's really, really unique. We've put in mostly indigenous plants and we've kept it simple so that the garden looks after itself making the house feel part of the scenery. You'll see now that the house is in shade that this is facing south. Um, it's got the view, but of course the north light comes from the other side. So you'll see when we walk through the rest of the house how the courtyard offers north light and brings a cool air through the house. This is a house that doesn't have a fireplace, which is not what you would have on the south coast. So we had other measures to introduce the climate control that was important. The open living area embodies the couple's warm, entertaining personalities, yet it presented a design problem. How to make each room within the open area stand out? Interior designer Rian Frey's solution began with getting his clients to Cape Town for two full days of choosing colours and fabrics to define each space. We had to give careful consideration to the colouring throughout the areas because they're so integrated. We went from a more muted in this area to a more intense in next door and also brought in more textured fabrics to keep it slightly informal. And Benita and David are quite big entertainers. Yes, that's why we focused so much on this area because it was the most important to them. We absolutely love sharing the space and the views with our friends. It's what this home is all about. Well, I could definitely be one of your friends after wow. looking at all of this. <laughs> you are. <laughs> You've kept the artwork quite minimalistic as well. We have, Lorna. We do have a problem in this area with the humidity, so the traditional art paintings do not work here. So we did ask for something totally different. Feature pieces like this were custom made. Our style is uncomplicated and cluttered. We didn't want curtains, we wanted to be able to see this ocean. We wanted to be able to see through the house and that is what it's actually like. I couldn't help but notice those futuristic stairs. They are super cool. Come, we've got to do this girl. <laughs> Absolutely. Lorna, this is what I was most excited to see finished. If you had seen what I had to walk up, to go upstairs and downstairs before they completed this, you would not be wearing these shoes today. <laughs> 
The other thing as well is we wanted to keep this free flow of space as you walked in going through. And so we went with no rail on this side of the steps. And it really does make a difference. Should we strut our stuff Let's without do it? it? Originally intended also to be home to their 23-year-old son, he's now moved out to start Varsity. But when he is here, this is his spot. Look who's here, Jason. This is Lorna. Lorna, this is my son, Jason. Oh, nice to meet How you. are you? <laughs> so, and this is where you hide. Yes, you finally made it up into my room. <laughs> hey, this isn't your room. <laughs> it actually is his favorite spot in the whole house. Yes, yes. Yeah. Why do you enjoy this space so much? It's just completely different from the house. When you come up here, it's a lot more homely for me. It's got the wood and the, the raw uh, walls and the more texture and the curtains and everything. And it's got the best view in the whole house, definitely. And Jason uses that view as a platform to the outside world. It's his quick exit. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> Luckily there's a pool out there, so you can just walk straight off the balcony and into the pool, which is absolutely awesome on a hot day. You're kidding me, right? I'll show you. Now? If you come with. <laughs> I will. <laughs> come with go. This family is exciting. <laughs> Alright, so here we are. Let's go, ladies. Okay. <laughs> I'll hold the shirt. <laughs> you go. We would say don't try this at home if Jason weren't already home. Whee! Oh! <laughs> my gosh! It looks so scary, but fun though. Lots of fun. Do you want to go next? We'll look at the rest of the house. I've got your shirt here. Mum enjoys more serene pleasures. Lorna, you'll see that the thread of the whole style of the house comes all the way through to our bedroom, but this is my own personal space and I absolutely love it. Imagine waking up in this bed, looking out at that view when you wake up in the morning. Absolutely priceless. I'm telling you, this is what it's all about. That's what living down here is about and the style of the house is about. We have kept everything simplistic, elegant, modern, again, uncluttered. But here, I do have curtains. <laughs> <laughs> I'd really like to take in the view from outside. Not only are you going to do that, but I've got something special, a little quirky thing for you. Anytime they want to feel they're out at sea, this is where they come. Lorna, this is our nautical stairway up to our own personal, no one else knows about it, lookout spot. You are welcome to go. I'm definitely going to take off my shoes. Be good. At first it was designed to access their solar geysers, but once they added a platform on top, they had 360 degree views. Wow, I can really see what you guys are talking about. Welcome to our crow's nest, Lorna. A little tradition in our family is that we always have a welcome cocktail for new friends. Don't worry, there's no alcohol in here. You'll be able to get down the ladder. <laughs> <laughs> and actually, we found our architect and our interior designer on your show, Top Billing. So here's to Top Billing. Cheers. Cheers. Well, I'm really glad you didn't sign that marriage contract. <laughs> <laughs> I'll drink to that. And to a peaceful sunset cruise without end.